Happy Tuesday, everyone. My name is Kathy Belargen, and I am the owner of Virtual Kathy. I am here with your top tip for this Tuesday uh, with a story, actually, about something that happened last week. So I get the Portland Business Journal, and in this journal, there are lists um, the, the list, which is um, businesses, biggest businesses in specific industries. And if the industry is one that could potentially be a good referral source for me, I will send uh, everybody on that list a handwritten note and uh, one of my business cards in there. The handwritten note is usually, you know, congratulations on being in the Portland Business Journal list. Um, hope you have a, a successful 2020. So I sent those out for business consultants. That was one of the lists. And I got a response to that, um, got an email saying, hey, thank you so much for the note. I just wanted to let you know that there is a broken link on your website. Would love to set up a time to chat with you. Here's my scheduling link. And when I saw that, I was like, hmm, I wonder if he's going to try and sell me something, right? Because maybe it's, you know, web development or whatever, but I really appreciated the fact that he acknowledged that he got his note and whether it was tit for tat, I figured, okay, it's a phone call. It's going to be 20 minutes of my time. Why not? So I scheduled myself a time to talk with him and I had that conversation last Friday and it was actually surprising. He did not talk about himself. Um, he was actually genuinely interested in virtual assisting services. So um, I told him that at the end where I was like, oh gosh, you know what? I, I honestly did not come into this conversation thinking that this was how the conversation was going to go. I, um, based on the email that you sent, I, I thought you would be selling to me really. Um, and he just laughed. He didn't even remember saying anything about the link. And so your top tip for this Tuesday would be that if you are having um, an interaction with somebody who may be looking to, I don't know, if they're coming across as that they're trying to sell something to you, if you can have a conversation, a short conversation or a Zoom call, 15, 20 minutes of your time, it may be worth taking that um, versus like a coffee date and an hour of your time. Uh, because they could genuinely be interested in um, learning more about your business and the opportunities that they may need. So um, I hope this is helpful. I hope you have a the great rest of your week.